Hey, what's up, buddy? I uh, am in some dire need right now. All my, right. Uh, com my computer, I had a power surge, and my computer is not turning All on right. now. It, the, the power surge is irrelevant. Remove it from your mind. You probably have a lot of fucking retards right now telling you that it shorted your computer somehow, but your power supply has built-in protections against that. There's no fucking way that any kind of power surge overloaded anything and broke anything, okay? So, get, so um, remove that from your mind immediately, okay? Okay, so what? All right, so tell me what's going on when you turn your computer on. You push the power button. Does it does it start to? I, yeah, yeah. All right, so I push the power button, and just literally nothing happens. The motherboard is on. There's two lights indicating the motherboard is on, but it just doesn't turn anything else on. Um. And this only happened out after the power surge, so I could have I assume it'd be the power surge. Have you tried, um, um, uh, wh where's your monitor plugged into at the moment? Uh, I have three DisplayPort monitors plugged in. Okay, can you try plugging one into your, uh, have you tried restarting it? The computer? Yeah, like turning it off completely and then restarting it? Yeah, I've unplugged it to the, uh, from the, the computer and like turned off the circuit and did all that. Didn't work. No idea what the issue is. I even tried taking out the battery and putting it back in, and it still didn't work. I even pressed the CMOS. Don't ever reset. take the battery out of your fucking uh, motherboard. Whoever told you to do that, ignore everything they ever tell you to do about computers again. Don't ever. You don't need to take the fucking battery out of your fucking motherboard. You did push the clear CMOS <laughs> Thanks, button, right? Thanks, is sad. He's my friend and moderator in the chat. That's Thanks, fine. dude. You, 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 I thought you, you pushed, knew what you were talking about. You pushed the clear CMOS button, right? I yeah. I I pre I held down a button that says reset on the motherboard. That says reset. Okay. And then I after you did that, that nothing is. happens. Yeah, no, nothing happens. Okay, but there are lights on on your motherboard, right? Yeah, the power light's on and some other red light. It's just one red light? Two. Two red lights. Do you have a speaker inside the motherboard? So, do they even, is it even, what kind of motherboard is it actually? Can you tell me that? A MSI X99A. All right, hold on one second. Ridiculous, man. Can't believe this, everybody. I know I was right. Bold is that. I don't know. It didn't work, so you weren't right. So I'll, clearly you weren't right because it didn't work. The reason why you take the battery out is because the um, motherboard can store some fucking information, and you can take the battery out to completely clear the... Um whatever settings are in there, but pushing the clear CMOS button is the same way of doing that. Taking out the battery is some shit that you did in 1999 before those buttons were made available on motherboards. These days, the clear CMOS button should be easy enough to wipe any UEFI or BIOS settings you have in that fucking motherboard. There's no reason to take the battery out. Um, it's not a horrible idea to do it. I'm sorry, I'm really told. I just played a really fucking stupid game and fucked you like, all right, hold on, let me look at your shit. There's nothing wrong with taking the CMOS thing out if you've tried everything else, I guess. It's, I'm just... Um, okay, you've got lights on. Um, yeah, two lights, dude. Where are these fucking lights at? The bottom right uh, of the motherboard? Uh, yeah, on the motherboard on the bottom. Um, hold on. And also, anybody who didn't know, Ryzenek won the giveaway. And Bubblers lost. I would have got him a prize, too. But he was being an asshole in chat, calling people fags. I don't appreciate that. Wow. So he, yeah, he, I did a, two rolls. Bubbler won first. It was glitched. So I didn't know he responded. It did another roll. The guy Bubbler was entitled as fuck. He was like, no, don't do the, don't do another roll. I already won, you know, and then, you know, you fag and blah, blah, blah. So I'm like, all right, well, fucking, it's all, it's, it's right. It's the other guy who wins then. Fuck you, Bubbler. Damn. I know, dude, fucking, what a bastard. Entitled as fuck for uh, something that I'm doing because I'm nice? Okay, buddy. It's not It's not yours because you fucking earned it, dog. It's because, motherfucking, I'm being nice and you got lucky. Don't be so entitled. Oh, my God, am I fucking blind? Fuck is troubleshooting. <laughs>
Are we good? Okay, getting uh, started. Yeah, I dropped my phone, so it's like, Memory, hey. Power supply, expansion slots, video, internal connectors, button, jumper, switch, installation, bio setup, OC, M flash, OC Bravo, hardware monitor, 328. What, does that button is it just on or does it display like a um like a like a number or anything uh, no it's just two uh things here let me see uh oh, it's so just cute. yeah it's just on the power button and then another red light that's just, i don't know what the fuck that is I think you got the X99 manual. He said it was the X99A. Oh, you're right. This is the wrong fucking thing. MSI X99 manual. Download. There's no oil in a PC. Stop fucking saying that shit. You guys think I'm stupid? You think I know? You think I don't know? There's not oil on a PC. You can cool it with a mineral oil. If some people submerge, <laughs> that's a different thing. I think they're talking about car oil, like oh. gas. Like uh, go put gas in it, you know? Oh. No, if I would never put gas in my computer. Good job, dude. <laughs> Thanks, bro. <laughs> Thanks, man. X99. Did I just download the same fucking thing? Well, you have the X99A. SLI plus? Does that sound right? Uh, probably. X99A Gaming Pro Carbon. Oh. X99A Gaming Pro Carbon Manual. X99, holy fucking shit. Does it have like tons of colors inside of it? Uh, it's, it's red. <laughs> it's just, I don't know, it just looks like a regular motherboard with red LED lights. Have you ever taken apart a computer and put it together before? Uh, no, I took apart the computer earlier and it was garbage after I was done with it. <laughs> do, you, do you remember when you turned it on the first time? Do you remember if it beeped or not? Uh, no, it doesn't, it didn't beep when I turned it on before. You're using too much energy? I don't think that's possible. I have a 1200 watt power supply, dude. I'm not using enough energy, in fact. In fact. Factually speaking here. If you want to be a smart ass about it. Oh, man. Is this really this hard? I mean, I don't know. I don't know what the problem is. Oh, no, is, I'm, so. I'm just trying to find. Hold on. RTBA linked me something. Oh, okay. Is this the right Who's manual, right? RTBA? Are you positive? X10 and Gaming Pro Carbon. Okay, this looks right. I'm just laying on the floor. Don't mind me, everybody. I don't know where to lay, dude. I'm fucking tired of shit. <sighs> when, do you, does the fan on your GPU spin? Do you know? Mm. <sighs> No, nothing works. Nothing works. Only the motherboard Wait, lights are on. So even the fan on the GPU is not spinning? Are you or what about the fans in the case? No. Oh. Only the motherboard light are on uh, lights are on. Nothing else is working. Wait, is the motherboard light does that come on right when you plug it in or is that only after you push the power switch? Right when I plug it in. Yeah, I don't have to hit the power switch for it to turn on. Okay. Um, do you know how to open the case? Yeah, the case is open currently. Do you know if that motherboard has an on switch, a start switch on it? Uh, yes, there's a power button. What happens when you push the power button on the motherboard? Nothing. I'll do it right now. Wait, okay. So that power Nothing. button, there are three buttons, and it's the one all the way to the left, correct? Yeah. Okay, and if you push the middle one or the right one, do those do anything? Try to change any lights or anything at all? Uh, I could try. Hit the reset, and then the other the other one's an overclocking button. Sure, yeah, let's fucking push it. Alright, reset, and overclock. Nothing? None of it does anything? Nope, nothing. Uh, 
Have you ever had a problem like this? Okay. When you when. It's not a dead motherboard. The lights on the motherboard are on. So. Um, can you unplug it real fast? Or actually, uh, don't unplug it. Just toggle the power switch on the back of the power supply. Can you do that? Okay. okay. All the lights off. inside are off now. Correct. Yeah. Everything's off. Okay. Can you push? Can you toggle that power switch one more time now? Turn it back on. All right. Hit the power switch. Turn it on. Okay, so now that red light inside lights up or whatever? Uh, let me turn it. I hit it. Let me turn it back on. Now. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah? So you have the power supply on, correct? Power supply is off right now. Wait, okay, turn the power supply on. The power okay. supply. Wait, do you know what that is? The circuit button? Yeah. Okay, it's on. Okay, now are there any lights on inside? Yeah, the same ones. Okay, they're on, correct? Yeah. Okay. okay. Can you push the power button, that button all the way to the left on the to turn it on, the power button on the motherboard? Can you push that? Does anything happen? I hear a click. When you turn it on, you hear a click? Yeah, I press the button and something on the back of the computer clicks. Don't know where it's coming from, but it's on the back of the computer. It's only two red lights. It's a reflection, guys. Fucking relax. Oh, you have this on your stream? Hold on. The troubleshoot numbers are at the top right of the motherboard. He can't even get it to turn on, guys. How are we going to get debug lights on? There are no lights on in the top right of your computer, are there? They give you a number? A debug code? On the top no. right of the motherboard? Yeah, no, because we haven't fucking turned it on yet. We're not going to get any debug numbers, guys, until the thing is actually turned on. Can you um, can you sweep your camera on the inside of the case so I can see it? Give me a nice shot of it. Yeah. Uh, okay. Okay, let me see the top right to make sure that... Okay. Where is the clear CMOS button on your... Do you know where that button is? Uh, it's usually I, on the very back of the computer. Like, usually it'll be sticking out of the back, like where you plug in your headphones and your USB cables and everything. Uh, have you pushed a button... Have you pushed a button back there called clear CMOS? I have not. Okay, do you see a button back there that says clear CMOS? Oh, I see. Yeah, clear CMOS. Okay, that's okay. the first thing we should have done. Did you push that button? Let's do it. Let yeah. me get a paper clip here. Okay. All right. Clear CMOS. Let's see. I figured the reset button was that. Okay. I pressed it. It's blinking. It was blinking blue. Okay. Okay. Now try pushing the power button on the motherboard or the case. <laughs> oh, what the fuck was that, dude? What just happened? I have no idea. Something exploded in my computer. Oh, my God. What the fuck? Dude, I have no idea. Did you fucking hear that shit? Did you hear that? Yeah, I heard it. <sighs> oh my, none of my light, none of, none of the power. The power in my room is not working now. Nothing in my room is working. The power is completely... Oh, what the fuck was that? Nothing's working in my room now. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Do you have your current computer and all that stuff plugged in? No, no. Well, yeah, I did. I had it plugged in. Do you, do you? This is. I don't know if you can answer this. Do you know if the sound came from inside your computer? Yes. You're one hundred percent positive that it wasn't just like a circuit flipping somewhere else in the um, house or somewhere else in the okay. room. I'm not really a hundred percent certain because I've got a million fucking surge protectors laying all over the place. But... Do you smell smoke or anything right now? From inside your computer case, do you smell smoke or anything? No. Okay, can you shine a light in there and see if anything is smoking or... Nothing is smoking, but the motherboard is now... Well, I'm assuming the motherboard's off because now, now I don't have any power in my room. Yeah. What the fuck? Why did everything in my room go off? What the fuck? Well, you, the circuit broke. The circuit flipped in your um for your room, I'm guessing. But why? I don't know. If you've never had, have you ever hooked a computer up to this particular socket before? Yeah, I, my last PC was attached to it, dude. I turn, I put the power button. I hear a fucking explosion. 
And now everything in my room is not working. Do you know where the circuit breaker in your house is? Or <laughs> I have... I don't know. Maybe, dude. Oh, now, not only do I have no computer, but I have no fucking power. Do you, is your uh, dad awake? Uh, no. <laughs> He's not. Okay, you have to flip. You There's a circuit breaker in your house that's going to be flipped right now. You have to flip that switch back to allow the flow of electricity to return to your room. Because oh, you, dude, I don't know. I'm going to lose all power in my entire fucking house, dude. Oh, no, nothing. No. It shouldn't be permanent. <sighs> Uh, Wait, do you have do you have multiple power surges a day? Yeah, I get a I get a bunch of power surges a day. Dog, that's not good for your shit. I know, uh, but that's why okay. I have surge protectors. Well, then, protectors. well, fuck. Like all of our, do you have power surges a day in your room, or is it across the entire house? Entire house. What the fuck, dude? Uh, yeah, I know, dude. I don't know what the fuck, dude. <laughs> No idea. That's why I have powers or surge protectors, but clearly they don't fucking work. Well, wait. What do you mean they don't work? You don't know that. They're working. Well, I mean, is all that... my shit's dead right now, so I. Well, because you don't have work. any electricity. Your power surge isn't going to give you electricity. Yeah, but then my PC was plugged into my surge protector, and it, it stopped working after that. I think it's still working. I think the clear CMOS button fixed it, and I think that when you just tried to turn it on now, it was ready to work again and turn on. But when you turned it on, it tried to dry, draw too much power from the wall, and it caused that circuit to flip. What are the odds, dude? Every day there's some fucking bullshit, isn't there? Yeah, but you gotta get... That shit is not good. You have to get that shit fixed. Because that, if... It could fuck your shit up. It shouldn't. It shouldn't. In 20 current year, with these expensive power supplies, with all these safety regulations and shit built in, it shouldn't fuck your shit, but... Dude, um, I had my shit plugged into a power a surge protector from, like, the 90s. All right, dog. Okay, listen up. Do you... So you're pretty much out of commission now. Do you want to see if your computer is working? Because we can go through a step, some couple steps real fast to make sure that it's actually working. Do you want? To, do you actually want to do this? Is up to you. How do I? Yeah. We okay. Power in my room. How you need to that? take. You need to take your computer and your power cable down to your kitchen. <laughs> Dude, I'm not bringing my whole PC to my kitchen. You don't have to bring a monitor. You just need the computer. You need the tower and you need a power cord. Or to a bathroom, if you have a bathroom. Oh, man, dude. Bathroom, bathroom, <laughs> bathroom, and, bathroom and kitchen uh, circuits will usually have the highest amount of amperage available to them because those are expected to run the heaviest devices in a house. When we when, when I cleaned carpets and we wanted to hook up our, our huge <laughs> fucking uh, carpet cleaner machines, um, the big power scrubbers, we would always have to run the wires to bathrooms or kitchens because those were the uh, only circuits that could handle the amperage and the uh, power requirements for the power scrubbers. Uh, so ba bathroom or um, <laughs> don't put this like in the fucking bathtub and turn the water on or any stupid shit. Like if you kill yourself doing this, I'm not liable at all. You know that, right? I, I might as well see if I'm okay. right. Oh, dude, motherfucking bullshit. Twelve hour stream, worst time, but this is not happening. My dad is sleeping right in the kitchen as well. It's gonna be so weird. It's gonna be so fucking weird. Or you could do bathroom too. Bathroom or bathroom or kitchen. Oh, fucking bathroom, dog. <laughs> all, all we're all we're gonna do is we're just gonna plug it in. We're gonna hit the clear CMOS button. We're gonna turn it on. We're gonna look at the debug indicator to make sure that everything's powering up correctly, so that at the very least you know your computer's working. That's it. And then and then, but this shit right here, this power stuff, you can't live in a place where you make a living. This is your job, right? Is doing stuff online. You can't have power surges five times a day. That's fucking crazy, dog. I. Yeah, dude, I don't know. It's just get an uh, like get an electric it's either the wiring could just be not up to par, like you might not have the wiring that delivers enough current. Like I, I don't I don't know how you're I don't know fuck all about internal wiring in a house and I don't know fuck all about any of this shit, but like something is obviously not working right, right? Like I I guess, dude. Motherfucking alright, let me bring my PC in here. Please second. like close the toilet and don't be near any water or don't turn on like the shower. Don't turn on the sink, right? You know these things, right? Why? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> All right. Yeah, yeah, dude. I'm gonna get my. Don't shit. go to the bath. Don't put it in the bathtub. Don't turn on any water. Okay, you can do this, dude. Okay, let's try this. Do you want me to hit this the clear CMOS button again? Yeah, first you have to have it plugged in, I think. Okay, hopefully. You don't lose power in my bathroom now. Do you have any last words or anything, just in case? Let's just pray to God. 
This is gonna be like the most popular video on live leaks if you go out like this, dog. Don't worry. I'll promote the fuck out of it, alright? This is this is scary. What are you doing right now? I'm trying to put this somewhere. Okay. You couldn't just leave it on the floor? Cable's not long enough. That's what she said. Okay, if, just so you know, if this thing falls off the counter and lands onto the floor, there's a good chance you're going to fucking destroy a ton of shit in the case. The GPU will probably tear out of the motherboard. The heatsink could rip off the slot for the CPU. I know, I know. <laughs> okay, no, dude. just don't let it fall off. Jesus, I fucking know, dude. <laughs> All right. Jesus fucking Christ. <sighs> okay. Okay, you have the power is turned on on the back of the PSU. What's going on? Are you okay? Yeah. Why do I hear banging? What are you doing, dude? Are you, hello? Okay, are you alive? Go, yeah. Are you okay? Yeah, yeah. Here we go. Here we go. I'm gonna okay. try and reset it now. Yeah. Make sure you got the power turned on on the back of the PSU. Oh God. Hello. Yes. Oh, you're power's okay. On. Okay. Oh! Oh. I can't do this, bro. Wait. Did it, did it happen again? Did it happen again? Did you see that electricity literally came out of the back of my computer? Okay, can you unplug this real fast? Oh, dude, I'm yeah. Your shit is fucked. Just unplug it. Yeah, just unplug it. Thing. Just unplug it. Something is super fucked with this, dude. This shit is fucked. This shit is actually like super fucked. Did you guys see that, dude? The uh, there was electricity that flew out. Unplug it. Unplug it. See? Unplug this shit, dude. Did it's unplugged? Okay. D do you know what standoffs are? This is like a total shot in the dark. Do you know what? No idea. Um, there's no chance, if he touches the motherboard, he can't be hurt now, right? Now that everything is unplugged and shit. Can what you shine, you mean, can you shine a flashlight into the, into the, into the computer case? And can you tell me if that motherboard is elevated off the back platform? Can you just look at it real fast? I'm just curious. I mean, it's, what do you mean elevated, dude? The motherboard should be slightly elevated. Like if you were to put your finger back there, you should be able to feel the edge of the motherboard and there should be space between it and the case. Can you just look and test if... It's it, complete. Doesn't look, it doesn't look like it, dude. It doesn't look like it. Can you take off the side oh. of the case and check? Everything is unplugged, so it should be okay. Uh. <laughs> yeah, why not, dude? Why not, dude? That's the fans. Dude, I don't know where the side of the case is. I don't know where shit is. There dude. should be two big screws on the back right of the case, okay? Are you alive? Hello? Yeah, hold on, dude. My shit turned off. <sighs> Your whole stream is going to think you're dead, dog. I know. They think I'm dead. My shit. I'm streaming from my phone, so it's really, it drops and shit, you know? Should be online now, hopefully. In a second here. Glitchy as fuck. It looked like he pressed something on the PSU, not a MOBO, like he stuck a screwdriver into the PSU. Did you do that? Yeah. I have this. Wait, why? Wait, you stuck a screwdriver into the power supply? No, just hit the the C the button, dude. Oh, oh, the clear CMOS button in the back? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. The new $5,000 computer died? Yeah, the fucking computer is... It's not working. I did... Why are you fucking with it? Bring back the bad bills to I, I'm trying to fucking fix it. I'm trying to see what the problem is. I would, I would just bring back the... I think it's using too much... Uh, what about you? What do you think, Destiny? Is it using too much power? No, it's, a, it's fucked, dude. You have to take it back to the guy. Yeah, it's it's super fucked. Like whatever's happened, like I would take it back to the like, guy. Like why? Like what do you think would be wrong with it? 
Um, well, what I was going to see is if there if there are no standoffs in the case, then that means that the case, that the motherboard is grounded against the case. So when you turn it on, the entire motherboard is shorting on the thing, which is causing. But it, it didn't out. happen like for the first ten hours of the stream. Oh, this was already running. Yeah, I was, oh. I had, I was, my stream was going for ten hours, and I had a power surge. Okay, then, then, I, then I, I don't know. Some, something is fucked. The, ba- the light, the everything is working in the bathroom still, right? You didn't like pop a circuit in yeah, there. Yeah, everything's right? working in the bathroom. Yeah, well, everything if you if you, if you if you plugged it in and turned it on, then something is severely fucked. To, uh, everything, yeah, everything in my room like's not working. None of the electricity is working. Turn this back on, probably. Okay. But you need to. Uh, I don't know what happened. Yeah, a spark came out of the back of the fucking computer. You need to bring it back to the guy that built it. I, I know, I just want to see what the issue is, because, like, what? the fuck, you know, it's like electricity's flying out of the shit, you know, the PC. What the fuck? I guess that's the only way. Oh, dude, I'm so mad. Am I even live right now, guys? I think I am, but, oh, dude, I'm so mad because <laughs> I'm not going to have a PC until he fixes it, because I fucked my old one up. Jesus fucking Christ. Um, so I'm scared of this. I'm scared of this. You don't have to, it's just electricity. There's nothing to be scared of. Just put it in the corner and don't use it. That's it's how fine. you die, bro. You motherfucker. Nah, electricity. you'll be okay. <laughs> okay. I mean, so you don't have any ideas. I, I doesn't. I don't. We don't have the tools necessary to diagnose the problems. Did this happen? This happened right when you turned the power on on the PSU. As soon as I hit this, as soon as I turned on the circuit, the fucking spark flew out. Yeah, so something is fucked with the PSU or the mother. I mean, it doesn't even sound like the motherboard. It might just be the fucking PSU. Uh, like I, like I guess if this, like if this but was a build though? of why I don't know. There's something I don't know. What kind of PSU is it? Is it a Corsair 1200i? Is that? Yeah. Um, is it a? That's not a CX line, is it? No, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It actually it doesn't matter. Is... Ma- what do you say, dog? Shut the fuck up. The Corsair's budget line is called the CX line. I, that's like a meme in your chat, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. Oh, you're yeah. not memeing? The no, CX I wasn't memeing. No, I'm sorry. Um, I think the CX line is their budget line. But, um, I mean, I, I if I was doing it personally, but I feel very comfortable with this stuff, I would probably swap out power supplies to test it. But that's a lot of work. Like, you've got to, un- you've got to disconnect the 24-pin from the motherboard. You've got to dis- uh, take off multiple 4-pins. You might have two 4-pins. You might have an 8-pin. It might be a 4 plus 4-pin. For the top part of the motherboard, you would have to undo all of the PCI connectors and all the state of power. Like, that's a, you might, you're pretty much building the computer by replacing the power supply at that point. Um, what about, so I've, so I've got to buy another power supply. Well, no, this guy should replace it for you. Like, it's dying. He should. I would fucking hope so, but I already paid him the money. I feel like I'm going to bring it back, and he's going to be like, oh, shit, more, pay me more money. He can't do that. Because You're a famous dog. We're famous, paid. dog. We're famous. We have leverage. We just get on our Twitters and make noise when Dude, people do that shit. Dude, I told him I was a live streamer. He's like, what's a, what's a live stream? He doesn't. It doesn't matter, though. Dog, if you tell him you have, how many followers you got on fucking Twitter? Like 30,000, 60,000, 100,000? What do you have? On Twitter? Yeah, 16. you're a big dude. 16,000. Yeah, there you go, dude. That's probably more fucking customers than this guy's done his entire life. Um, I, actually, I do have a warranty, so... It doesn't it matter. No, 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 no. no. Listen, listen dog. It, back, it doesn't man. matter if you have a warranty or not. You, a guy can't build a computer for you and you have it blow up 10 hours after using it. If his shop is that much of a piece of shit that he won't warranty his work, that's unfucking believable. Then tell him I you're going to... I mean, he might. I'm just thinking because I already paid him the money that he might say. Yeah, he shouldn't, though, because he should be shit. like a good bonus or business owner that wants to make sure that his customers aren't getting absolutely fucked out of their money. Like, you have to, you have to call him... Destiny, did he change the PSU to a different voltage? If this is a 1200 watt PSU, it should have an auto voltage regulator on the back. Do you even have a volt? Do you do you have a voltage s- switch on the PSU to go from um, what is it, 240 Dude, I to don't 110? Even know what the hell the PSU looks like? Yeah, no, don't worry about it. No, it's probably an auto switch. I don't even think those buttons exist anymore in modern day. Use my laptop. I'm not streaming from a laptop. That is AIDS, dude. Fuck that shit. After streaming from with a three monitor setup, I can never go to a one monitor laptop. Fucking 15 inch. No. No, dude. No. Just don't tell your shop your constant power outages. I mean, it's so weird how all this is happening after that power outage. So obviously, but it's in a surge protector. I don't want to have this problem every time a fucking power outage goes out. Like, you know? Okay, but listen. The fact that you pop, the fact that you pop that button, um, and as soon as you turned it on, your shit got fucked in that room, but the circuit's still fine because you obviously don't. You still have power to that room, right? Yeah. 
obviously something is going on with that shit. Well, wait, th is there power to the outlet? Do you have like a phone that you can plug in? I could try to see if there's power to the outlet. Let me see. Let's see if the outlet has power. Uh, let me see, dude. What can I use? Let's use this. Please don't disconnect. Let's see. Hey, where was that? Where was that clear? Oh God. I can't, oh, I forgot. No, my phone isn't charging. I don't have any power. We're about to rip stream on one percent. We're about to rip stream. We're about to rip stream. He doesn't need a screwdriver uh, for this. Oh uh, no! What uh, did he poke? <laughs> I can't. I can't do it. I can't do it. Yeah, I do. Yeah, I'm just gonna bring this PC back to the shop. I don't know what's going on. It's fine. This IS sent you hey, a lot, real but fast. here's five um, for putting up with our daddy ice less than three. Well, I mean, I, I don't think it's the amount of stuff that I've plugged in that's going to cause a power outage. Yeah, no. Why would the PC blow up? I think you're drawing too much power from one thing here. Yeah, we'll plug into a triple plug there. I have it plugged into this one, the better one. That one right there. You must be using too much drawing too much power for, for, the, for the breaker on the wall. I don't know about that. Oh! Wait, hey. What? Yeah. What are you, Hello? what are you sticking yeah. that's, what are you, what are you sticking the screwdriver into? I stick the screwdriver into the, the button, dog. You told me to press. What? Oh, God. Wait, which button? Into the fucking CMOS thing, dude. Can't. <laughs> What it, can you take a picture of it or show me close up? Is your stream still on? No, I just died. My phone died. Nowhere to plug it in at. It just it literally said CMOS. Oh said, dude. CMOS on it. I what? I I don't know, man. It literally says clear CMOS on okay, it. Okay. Listen, look at the back wait, in the back of your computer. Okay, in the back of your computer, in between your USB ports, do you see a button that says clear CMOS? Yes. Can't you push that with your fingers? No, it's it's too far in. It's in like a fucking hole. Okay. They, you need to get like a pen or something to hit it. Okay. When when I'm looking at your stream here and you're turning back on this shit, when it when you when you're in the bathroom, what did you do to turn on the power supply? I turned on that button that's in the back that has like the circle and the line on it. Okay. Yeah. Why I'm looking at this in the bathroom, it looks like you're sticking a screwdriver into the bottom of the computer. And that's no, no, where the I, spark I, I, no, comes I, from. It, it was a it was a thin screwdriver because I didn't have a pen, and I plugged and I used it to hit the clear CMOS that you can't hit with your hand. Okay, wait. Where is the clear CMOS button? It's nowhere near the bottom. It's near the top, right? No, it's in between two USB. Yeah, near the top right. Okay, or top left. Why is it then in the bathroom? Why does it look like you're using a screwdriver to turn on the power supply in the bottom left? Uh, I don't know. I'm gonna have to watch it back. I don't have any idea man <laughs> because i'm looking at this spark and it looks like you literally just stuck the screwdriver into the power supply and that's where the spark came from no the spark came, i don't know the spark came from the bottom yeah but if i send you a link can you explain to me what exactly you're doing are you able to look at it on your phone yeah 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 i have the ipad still yeah dude okay i'm sending you a link on skype okay oh good you're live so we can see this as well Wait, who's we? Uh, me. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, okay. Yeah, just You're play holding it on, a screwdriver. I'll play it on your stream again. Okay, I'll play it on my stream. Okay, and I'll talk. What's going on? Okay, so I see you coming in here. All right. Yeah, I see your shit on your computer. And then at this point, hold on. Let me. Make sure you have the power turned on in the back of the PSU. Oh, uh, hello. Yes, okay. power's on. Okay. Why do you? Why do you? Why do you? Why do you poke it? What's going on here, dude? What do you mean? I, what you I like? You hit the button. Dog, if you want to fucking off yourself or some shit, don't fucking bring me into this fucking world of pain. What's what, what do you? What's going on down here? It looks like you're just sticking the fucking. This is where the spark is coming from. You're just like sticking a fucking screwdriver. No. What? Tell me what you're doing here. Make sure you have the 
No, no, it looks. I know what it looks like. <laughs> that, man, I, that's I what it looks like, dude. In my, oh, God, hello? Yeah. I just had the screwdriver in my hand, and I used the the turn on the button. You're not that screwdriver is not sticking into the computer at all. I know. I need to clean up my just the room, my dude. Hold on, man. Yo, yeah, yeah. Sure. Clean the room. I'm just trying to figure this out. Too much fucking uh, energy. Too much energy drink. Yeah. The dankest dungeon. I think he forgot he no, had the I put screwdriver, that screwdriver in his and I hand when he pressed the button. Button, dude. And then I used my finger with the screwdriver in my hand to turn on the circuit. I didn't put the screwdriver in the computer. You're positive you didn't accidentally, maybe clumsily. No, there's not even anything to put the screwdriver in down there with. Well, I mean, no, you could stick the screwdriver into the back of that. The PSU is the, the housing with the button on it, that on-off oh, switch. I'm pretty sure I did not put the screwdriver in there. So okay. what if I did, though? What? Then you're shorting something. That's where the spark is coming from. I, I mean, maybe. Do you, under, I do, you under, do you know what a short is? Yeah, so, like, no. Dude, that shit. <laughs> No, don't, don't say my shit. Okay. Fuck, man. Listen, listen, listen. Can, are you listening? Put your listening ears on real fast, okay? Yeah. Okay. Calm. Take a deep breath for me. <sighs> Wait, listen. Your belly needs to fill with air. Fill your diaphragm, not your chest, okay? A deep, calming breath. And exhale, okay? You got that? Uh, I feel like I'm doing yoga. Okay, that's okay because it calms you, all right? Okay. On a motherboard, there are a ton of different components, and all of these components are rated for different levels of electricity. Does that make sense? Okay. Okay. Now, you can't just connect all of these things to each other. They all have very specific connections in, in the way that they work. Does that make sense? Okay. They're all connected, right? When you look at a circuit board, you see all the lines connecting very specific things, right? Okay. Okay. When you connect two things together that aren't supposed to be connected together, what you're doing is you're creating a shorter pathway for the electricity to flow through. That's why it's called a short. You're shorting the circuit. Okay? Does that make sense? Uh -huh. You're connecting two things together that aren't supposed to be connected together, right? Uh huh. So when you stick some kind of conductor into a complicated piece of circuitry, what you're doing is you're allowing electricity to flow from one part of that board to another part where it's not supposed to flow. You could either permanently damage a part or you'll cause some kind of regulator to trip that will turn everything off. Okay? That's a short circuit, right? Okay. Okay. So, I do you, do you see how when I look at this clip how it looks like there's a it looks it literally looks like not only does it look like you jammed the screwdriver into the bottom, but that's exactly where that spark looks like it's coming from, right? Okay, it, maybe I accidentally did it. So what does that mean? <laughs> So what does that mean, though, in layman's term? What I mean, it could mean that the PSU is permanently damaged. It could mean that it's not damaged at all, and you could just do this exact same thing, but don't stick a screwdriver in it and turn it on, and it'll be fine. At this point, I'm not really comfortable advising you to do anything because you could legitimately kill yourself or blow your fucking shit up. I don't actually know. What do you mean, dude? I paid so much money for this computer. I'm, I'm going to... I'm so I mad, like dude. like I'll lose my job. Like I literally won't nobody will watch my stream if I fucking cause you to kill yourself on stream, okay? So I'm just looking out for myself. I got a fucking kid to feed, all right? And people to fucking and bitches to fuck and people to take care of and Aslan to feed. All right. I got people that depend on me. I've got houses, mortgages, bills to pay. So I can't kill you on stream, okay? So I cannot advise you to redo what you're doing, knowing that you just accidentally Stuck a screwdriver. <laughs> I mean, I feel like if I would have put the screwdriver in there, I would have been electrocuted. Why was What I? kind of handle is the screwdriver? Is it a plastic handle? No, it's all metal. You're positive? The entire thing is metal? There's, it's not coated with paint or anything? It's not a screwdriver. It's, it's li a you're rhythm. literally holding a hunk of metal in your hand. There's no paint, literally, no plastic, it's, nothing. It, well, it's not a screwdriver. It's a, it's a rivet. It's a, the entire thing's metal. <laughs> I don't know, dude. I, do you have shoes on? I did. I, I don't know, man. I. You, 
Here's no, okay. Uh, this is what I would do. But I listen. I feel really comfortable working on this stuff. Okay, this is all up to you. I know. Can you tell me, Destiny, Stephen Bonnell? I understand that you have no liability for what you're telling me. I understand that you have no liability, no responsibility for anything, any events that may or may not occur. No, fuck that. Shit. No, you gotta no, tell me. I'm not gonna that. fuck because I'm not gonna get fucking no, sued. What the hell are you saying? What are you? I'm not, dude. Do you hear that life? fucking rapper? They just went to about. just caught a fuck. He caught a seven year fucking sentence because Yo, he fucking dude. fessed up to murdering someone in a fucking fuck rap that, song. You don't bro. think that? shit could happen to me on fucking stream okay steven my, my, my fucking steven if you kill me that's fine dude i'm cool with it <laughs> can you don't okay oh my god put put you have to put down all the devices all of the highly conducive metal that you're holding on to, you cannot stick that into the computer. You have to put all of that down and get it out of your hands completely. I, mean, I don't think I did. Put all of it down. You have to put it all down. I don't know, dude. Put it all down completely and get like put it all away, dude, away I'm from you. I'm scared as fuck to go near my own computer. I. She, how far away is the dude? Uh, he's like ten minutes. I'm okay. Waiting for him to open. Yeah, I think we. Sh I think that's like we should just do that. Okay. I'm gonna. This I'm is worth. This is like a. Call, this is a risk. Afraid, this is a risk reward. You're not gonna die from it. Just don't plug it back in and just take it back to the dude and tell him that it's causing some problems. Okay. All right. Yeah, I think that's I really your hope best. It doesn't take him long to fix it though, because like I don't have a computer now. <laughs> don't you have your normal computer? No, we broke it. <laughs> Unbuilding it. We broke that shit to pieces by accident, so now I'm fucked. Oh, what the fuck am I gonna do? You're gonna have to live that normie life, dog. Don't you have a phone? No, you can go stream. Go Didn't you stream Pokemon Go for a while? That one girl walked up and she wanted your autograph and everything. I watched that video, right? <laughs> hey, yeah, she's a cutie, man. Then there you go, dude. Uh, but hey, you motherfucking Pokemon Go every day. That's fucking stupid. Yeah. But, ah, uh, dude, I don't know, man. I'm just angry. Wouldn't you be angry? What? <laughs> I don't, dude. It looks like you literally stuck a piece of metal into dude, the. Dude, I just hate my life. I'm trying to end it all. Oh my and try god. And make it your fault so you go to jail and go down with me. Oh, dude. I don't even know what's going on. Dankest dungeon. Ah uh, man. Steven, all I right, didn't dude. think getting I mean, into youth in Asia is a sound really business do, plan. Uh, I'm just gonna take it back to the dude, and hopefully there's some good news that comes from it. Yeah, take him back. Don't tell him. Listen, don't tell him fucking anything, okay? You understand? I'm you just, just take it in and you him. say, hey, it stopped turning on. That's all you got to say, all right? Don't say that's, anything that's, else. I don't say nothing. You don't want me to say nothing like the power surge? No, fuck that shit. Don't tell him. Don't. You don't want to say anything that's going to make you assume liability, okay? Because as soon as you open your fucking mouth and say some shit like, oh, well, maybe there's a power surge, he's going to be like, oh, well, dude, your house fucked it up. I can't touch it, okay? Don't none of that shit, okay? All right, Get I'll him to like, accept your EULA yeah, dude, and make just, sure he kills himself on your stream. On yes. The views would listen, be off the chain. Listen to me, okay? Mm -hmm. You are an American, all right? Do you understand that? You're going American. to an, an American business. The only, the number one opportunity, this, the number one thing this guy is going to look for as soon as you bring this shit in is he's going to try to find some way to pawn the problem off on you. You cannot fucking no, say, fuck that guy, okay, no. but listen, you can't fucking open your mouth and say anything relating to what has happened here tonight at all. Don't mention any power surges. Don't mention any electrical problems in your house have ever happened ever. Don't, you're literally on the CIA's fucking interrogation torture power grid with the most reliable electricity in the fucking world if he asks, okay? CIA, you literally, you're literally on Guantanamo's fucking grid if he asks, okay? It's wired all the way to your fucking house, okay? Infidel. Yes, okay? You didn't stick any screwdrivers into anywhere. You didn't open anything or look at anything or whatever. Oh, all it did was turn off. You take it hey, in I turn. don't even, hey, what, what screwdriver? Okay, exactly. Hey, there you go, dude. Take it in. Hey, what's a screwdriver? I don't even know there you what a screwdriver go, dude. is. If the guy is worth this fucking shit, then he'll be able to tell that you fucked with something, and then he'll tell you that it's fucked anyway. Even if there is something shorted, it's possible to probably RMA the PSU. These guys don't give a fuck these days with parts anyway. You can RMA anything, and they'll send you another part. All right, but just don't assume liability when you go in, okay? Yeah, man. I just hope he doesn't charge me another fucking amount of money that you charged me to build that You're fine, shit. dude. You're fucking loaded, dude. You're fine. You'll be okay, all right? You need the computer. I'm loaded? What do you mean? I don't, I'm not loaded. What I mean, you have to look at this. Do you know what opportunity cost means? Dollars. Okay, do you know what opportunity cost means? Uh, 
Okay, okay this, let's this say that I pay you. Let's say that I want you to come over and mow my yard. And it's let's say that I've got a huge fucking yard and it's going to take you all day to mow it and I'm going to give you $100 to do it. Would you say yes or no to that? To mow your lawn for $100? Yeah, and it'll take you eight hours to do it. Uh, fuck no. Why not? Fucking, what's that? $2 an hour? What you mean? So why wouldn't you do it? Because $100, motherfucking, I could go get that somewhere else. Exactly. That's opportunity cost. When you, If you could stream and you could make $800, but instead you do something else, you're, you're, the opportunity cost is the money that you would have earned streaming. So if you go back tomorrow, and even if you have to pay another 100 bucks or whatever, right? If you say, no, fuck that, I'm going to do it myself. Every day you're not streaming, you're losing, what, three, four, five, six hundred dollars $600 every single day you're not streaming? So you can't eat those losses just because you don't want to pay somebody else. Even if you have to pay them fucking $300 to fix your shit, you'll make that money back in a night. And then the next day, and then the next day, and the next day, you'll be streaming, right? You, the opportunity cost of not having a system is not acceptable, right? You have to have your computer working to, like as soon as possible, right? You You're right. You're actually right, dude. Okay. So even if you've got to pay some money, it's worth it because you'll make it all back and more, right? Rather than not having a computer at all, okay? Opportunity cost means That's having true. to deal yeah, with this literal That's fucking true. retard in uh, return for his but, but, yeah, viewers. But, like, you, everything else... Even if the power supply is all fucked up and shit, like everything else should be okay, right? Like the yeah. GPU. And uh, the I don't, CPU and <laughs> dude. I don't know. You don't know, dude. Everything fine. should be fine, dude. Too much money on everything that should be. be fine, but I can't fucking guarantee anything, dog. I don't even fucking know. I'm never out. spending more than a thousand dollars on a PC again. <sighs> all right, good luck, dude. You can do it, all right? All right, dude, I believe in you, help, man. man. All right, after you get back, if you want, you can. If you're having problems, listen, okay. I don't like to come to you because I don't want to feel like I'm leeching viewers or like I'm doing right the dick ride because that's what all the Twitch people do. If you have problems, you can message me and I'll help you, right? If you, if you want to do it off stream or whatever, just your shit is good, okay? But you can do it yeah, before, dude, but do it, not, yeah, but do no, it before, nice do it, sure, out, no, I'm not just a nice guy. I mean, I do get viewers helping you out. I mean, don't think I don't know that, but, but you do, but it's okay. better to come and ask me a question before you get to like catastrophic failure states. <laughs> Like, does that make yeah, sense? I know, dude. Okay. I, I'll, I'll okay. do that, man. Okay. Thanks, dude. All right. I love you, buddy. Okay. Good luck. See ya, bro. All right. Yeah. Peace out. <laughs> okay. Someone in my Twitch chat said that's called comparative advantage, not opportunity cost. That's the textbook example of opportunity cost. Comparative advantage has is completely and totally different. I can explain that to you if you don't know what that means. But this has nothing to do with comparative advantage whatsoever. Holy fuck. I'm sorry, because somebody random brought it up. Comparative advantage is comparative advantage means let's say that I can make fifty computers a day and I can make ten chairs a day, and let's say that I've got a friend who can make a um, hundred chairs a day and two computers a day, and we both manufacture all of that shit. Well, let's say that he moves all of the computer manufacturing to me, and then I export all of my chair manufacturing to him. Overall, together, an economist would look at that and see a net gain in the overall efficiency of that system, and you would say that the two people engaged in a trade that um, emphasized or took advantage of their comparative advantages, which allowed them to do what they were both best at, right? That's what um, comparative advantage is. Comparative advantage is quite a bit different than opportunity. I mean, I guess they're kind of sort of related, but... <clears throat> Stop fucking spamming my fucking chat. We don't do this shit in my chat, all right? Take this fucking bullshit ass spam and run it to fucking Soda or Recful's chat. We don't do that shit in here, okay? This emoji cancer spam. Destiny, bro, don't tell them to touch the motherboard after unplugging it. It could still electrocute him. A motherboard can electrocute you after unplugging it? Are you sure about that? A motherboard is going to electrocute you. You're telling me that a part that everybody's scared will literally be damaged from a little itty bitty fucking static shock is going to electrocute you. Are you sure about that? Have you actually taken an Econ 101 class? Nope, I listened to a tape on Econ 101, so I know all the Econ 101 turns, terms. That's how I know. That's where all my econ shit came from. I'm pretty sure you can even go to my what CD account and you could see the- We can listen to it someday on the fucking stream, okay? 
Shit, Motherboards equals capacitors equals capacitors store electrical charge for periods of time. Oh, and capacitors, every single capacitor. I actually, I'm not gonna lie, I actually majored in electronic engineering. One of the first things that they teach you in electronic engineering, I'm fucking going, I don't give a fuck. One of the first things they teach you is that every single capacitor ever built, part of the technical definition to be called a capacitor is it must be able to store a charge sufficient enough to kill an adult human, right? I think that's like part of the definition, right? Every single capacitor ever made will typically carry the, enough charge to kill an adult human. Is like the qual isn't that isn't that how they're defined?